All right, so a quick update on the high aspect wings. The new fuselage and stuff is all done. I'll show you show that in a minute. <clears throat> but um, for the wings, so this is the 1150. This is the one I built in the demo with the carbon. Uh, so this is another core that I cut out. And this is the what's going to be the middle size. And I think I had it at 915, something like that, millimeters in, um, in span. And then I'm going to do one more. I just need to design that up and then run the tool paths. It's going to be a little bit smaller than this, maybe in like the 875 range, but not a too much smaller because uh, we're already kind of getting down there on the size. So these are the blanks and I've changed up or I'm trying a new method in terms of milling these things out. So you may remember in the initial uh, build videos, the trailing edge was getting really thin and then it was getting blown out as it was being milled. And so that was an issue. And I cut those two out. They turned out okay. I, I'm still having some issues, but it's something that needs to be addressed. And so I think really the best way to do it is just to put on one little skin layer of fiberglass on the bottom side. The bottom side gets cut first, so there's still, you can see underneath here, we still have like the solid uh, rest of the plywood core there. So I cut out these two sizes, I skinned them, uh, you let a lot of epoxy get in there, and then just one layer of four ounce glass. And so I'm hoping what that does is it really stabilizes that trailing edge and allows us, or allows the mill to get in there and, and get that trailing edge down real thin without having any huge blowouts. So I haven't tried cutting these yet. Uh, these are curing up, they're just about cured, but in a couple hours I'm gonna throw them on and give them a try. And, and hopefully that issue is solved. It'd be really great if it is. And then, um, yeah, that'll just overall lead to way better cores. So that's the idea here and hopefully it works. All right, so I got the smaller wing cut out and that worked amazing. Putting that one layer of fiberglass on the bottom is great. Like that, that's how these are gonna be done. It was able to machine this edge down perfectly. It is razor thin. There's a ton of strength to it. And even the tips get nice and thin as well. So. That's definitely the way to go. It really works out well and uh, just gets a way better, you know, I won't have as many throwaways or repairs to do. And it just overall, it just makes a better core. And then on top of that, as far as shipping goes, um, you know, that'll keep that trailing edge more protected and prevent things from breaking during shipment. So you can see, I mean, it is basically down to like razor thin as it is on the model so that trick worked great and um yeah that's definitely how they're all going to be done 